Physicists widely agree that the universe began with a cataclysmic event called the Big Bang, approximately 13.7 billion years ago. This monumental occurrence was not just the beginning of matter, but also the birth of space, time, and energy itself. It set in motion the processes that would eventually create the stars, galaxies, and planets we observe today. Yet, despite decades of research, fundamental mysteries remain. What triggered this event? Why did it happen at this particular moment? And what existed, if anything, before the universe began? These questions have fascinated scientists and philosophers alike for centuries. The Big Bang Theory, while widely accepted, is not just a story of beginnings. It is a framework built upon decades of careful observations, mathematical models, and experimental evidence. Modern astronomy shows that the universe is expanding, a discovery first made by Edwin Hubble, who noticed that galaxies are moving away from us, their light stretched into red wavelengths, a phenomenon known as redshift. This expansion continues today and is accelerating, driven by a mysterious force known as dark energy, which constitutes roughly 68% of the universe's total energy. Acting almost like an anti-gravitational pressure, Dark energy pushes galaxies apart, ensuring that the universe grows ever larger with time. Yet science is never static. Each technological breakthrough allows us to look deeper into the cosmos, often challenging long-held assumptions. The James Webb Space Telescope, or JWST, represents one of the most significant leaps in our ability to explore the distant universe. Launched with the goal of peering further into space and further back in time than ever before, JWST's powerful infrared instruments allow it to see through cosmic dust and gas that previously concealed the universe's earliest structures. Its observations are not only breathtakingly beautiful but also deeply informative, revealing details that challenge the very foundations of our cosmological models. One of JWST's most astonishing discoveries is the detection of over 750 previously unseen galaxies. These galaxies exist in epochs when the universe was still in its infancy, just a few hundred million years after the Big Bang. Remarkably, many of these galaxies are smaller, smoother, and far more organized than models had predicted. Traditional theories of cosmic evolution suggest that young galaxies should be chaotic, irregular, and clumpy, shaped by violent mergers and intense star formation. Yet JWST's images show galaxies with clear disks, spiral arms, and orderly structures, features typically associated with much older galaxies in the nearby universe. The implications of these observations are profound. If galaxies could form mature and stable structures so early in cosmic history, the traditional understanding of galaxy formation, built on hierarchical growth through collisions and mergers, may need to be reconsidered. This challenges our assumptions about how matter clumped together after the Big Bang and raises questions about the efficiency and mechanisms of galaxy formation. Some scientists even suggest that our models of dark matter, which plays a crucial role in shaping galaxies, may require revision, or that entirely new physics might be at play. The sheer number of galaxies observed also defies expectations. Current models of cosmic evolution predicted far fewer galaxies at such early times. This unexpected abundance suggests that the universe was capable of forming large-scale structures faster than we imagined. Moreover, these galaxies' smaller-than-expected sizes contradict predictions based on cosmic expansion, where more distant objects should appear larger or more diffuse. JWST is showing us that the early universe may have been more structured and mature than previously assumed, forcing astronomers to rethink the very timeline of cosmic history. To put this in perspective, the Big Bang Theory describes the universe's origin from a singularity, a point of infinite density and temperature, where the laws of physics as we know them cease to apply. Following this singularity, cosmic inflation caused space to expand at unimaginable speed, stretching spacetime faster than the speed of light. 
This rapid expansion smoothed out irregularities and set the stage for the large-scale structures we see today. As the universe cooled, particles combined to form the first atoms, initiating processes like nucleosynthesis and eventually leading to the formation of stars and galaxies. JWST's recent findings suggest that the standard model of galaxy formation may be incomplete, and perhaps even oversimplified. Traditionally, astronomers believed that galaxies formed gradually over billions of years, through repeated mergers of smaller structures and slow accretion of gas and dark matter. But the presence of smooth, well-structured galaxies so early in cosmic history challenges this assumption. It implies that some regions of the universe evolved far more rapidly than previously thought, forming large, stable galaxies within a few hundred million years after the Big Bang. This revelation has profound implications. It raises critical questions about cosmic expansion and the role of dark energy and dark matter in shaping early galaxies. If galaxies could grow so quickly and remain orderly, we may need to rethink not only how galaxies form, but also how the universe itself evolves over time. Could the mechanisms driving galaxy formation be more efficient than we imagined? Or is there physics at play that we have yet to discover? The answers may require significant revisions to our current cosmological models. These extraordinary observations have also opened the door to alternative theories about the cosmos. Some scientists suggest that the universe might operate in cycles, periods of expansion followed by contraction, challenging the notion of a one-time Big Bang event. Others explore modified theories of gravity, proposing that the laws of physics themselves might behave differently on the largest scales. Some researchers even entertain the idea that the speed of light was not always constant in the early universe, a concept that could help explain the surprisingly rapid formation of these massive, structured galaxies. While these ideas remain speculative, they illustrate an essential truth about science. It is not static. It thrives on curiosity, skepticism, and the willingness to question long-held beliefs when confronted with new evidence. The success of JWST is not just a story of scientific discovery. It is also a story of human ingenuity and collaboration. Engineers, astrophysicists, data scientists, and theorists from around the world joined forces to design instruments capable of detecting the faintest signals from billions of light years away. Advanced algorithms and machine learning processes then help to sift through vast amounts of data, reconstructing clear images from what would otherwise appear as noise. Every pixel, every faint signal, carries a story about the universe's history, allowing us to explore epochs that existed long before Earth or even our solar system came into being. Beyond the scientific significance, these discoveries carry a philosophical weight. They force us to confront the sheer scale and complexity of the universe, and in doing so, they provoke awe, humility, and curiosity. When we observe these distant galaxies, each containing billions of stars, countless planets, and untold histories, we are reminded of how small we are in the cosmic scheme. Yet, at the same time, we are participants in this story, using our intellect, technology, and imagination to glimpse the workings of a universe far larger and older than ourselves. Joost's images are more than snapshots, they are windows into the formative years of the cosmos. They show us that galaxies, even at an early age, can be beautifully ordered, challenging assumptions about chaos and randomness in the young universe. They also hint at a universe that may operate according to rules we do not yet fully understand, a universe capable of surprising us at every turn. Each observation is a reminder that science is a journey, not a destination. Our models, no matter how sophisticated, must always be flexible enough to adapt to new evidence. The telescope's discoveries also highlight the importance of interdisciplinary collaboration. Astronomical research today depends on engineers, software developers, theorists, and observational scientists working together. Advanced instruments like JWST would be impossible without this collaboration, 
and interpreting its data requires a combination of physics, mathematics, and computational expertise. It is a testament to what humanity can achieve when knowledge, technology, and imagination converge.